There we go. Guess we need a camera there. Um, but good morning. I'm going to show you how to do your electrical plans. Uh, now, for starters, you've probably placed a lot of lights and things into your floor plans of you know your original plan here, and uh, which is perfectly fine. But um, there's another way that we do the electrical plans, and uh, we have to do it this way to get the wiring and stuff like that into our our plans. Um, and that is, we're actually going to create an electrical plan. Now, once you create the electrical plan, you can also put lights in there, and it's really up to you if you want to put them in your floor plan um, or if you want to put them into your electrical plan. But um, let's say let's say I've got a fan right now. I think I have some can lights too in there um, for my uh, for that particular room right there. So we'll probably see that when I do the electrical plan. But anyhow, um, to do an electrical plan, we're, we're going to go up. To the file tab right up here we're going to click on that we're going to click new and we're just going to create a new project okay and we're going to create a project template we're going to browse and we need to find the electrical default okay now this is going to give us all the tools we need for our electrical plan uh, wiring and um, switches and things like that. Formally, you could put in switches and receptacles and things into your your regular floor plan, into your original floor plan. But now, uh, the only way that I've found to do it is through the electrical uh, template itself. So I'm going to open that. Click OK, and it's doing some updating here. Okay, so now <clears throat> I have my electric plan. You see I have different, uh, just like in my regular original plan, I've got floor plans, ceiling plans. Now I have power plans. <clears throat> my floor plans actually include lighting. Uh, ceiling plan <clears throat> includes ceiling electric. Um, and all of that good stuff there. Okay, so what do we do from here? Well, we, we still need to plan based on our original uh, drawing. So what we have to do is link our original drawing into this plan. To do that, we go up here to the Insert tab. Okay, we go over here to it says to where it says Link Revit. Click on that, and it gives us this dialog box. So we're going to find, go back here and, and let's see in my documents. You know, I want to link this particular file in here. Um, I think, let's see, I'm going to see what happens here because I'm, I'm suspecting this cannot be loaded into another open doc or cannot be loaded because it is loaded into another open document. That's cool. That's okay. All right. So I'm going to close my original file here okay and I'm going to save changes to it all right now I should be able to link it okay so here's my original file new res underscore fuller underscore 2018 okay now it is linked and of course you can see all my light fixtures that I have in there now Okay, so that is how you create your electrical, or start creating your electrical plan. That's how you link the file. Okay, so we're in here. We're linked now. Uh, the next video, I'll come back and show you uh, how we uh, can place switches and receptacles and things like that.